a step-by-step -step guide to teach your dog to roll over. If you are a pet lover and are most fond of dogs, training them to sit, stay, and lie down are just the basics in taking care of them. You would be one of the happiest dog owners once your dog starts to learn different tricks. In this case, you're about to know the steps on teaching your dog the rollover trick. It may seem like a difficult trick to attempt, but rest assured that you will be impressed with what your dog is about to learn. Dog owners need to be committed to teaching their babies different tricks because this also serves as a fun bonding experience for you and your dog. The rollover trick is one of the most impressive tricks your dog can do, and it might be the cutest one too. A step-by-step -step guide to teach your dog to roll over. A trick setup. 1. Ensure that your dog knows how to lie down. Lying down is one of the essential first steps in order to complete this trick. So, if you haven't achieved this step yet, then command your dog to lie down. Training them first to respond in this command is our first goal. You can also initially put your dog on his side to make it easier for him to learn rollover. 2. You'll need lots of small treats on hand. Provide your dogs with different kind of treats that is new for their taste buds or treats they don't usually get. You can give treats like lean meat, cheese, chicken, or any food your dog loves to eat. These rewards you're about to give can motivate them more to learn rollover. Make sure that you break them into small bites and are sufficient to last throughout the whole course of their training. Always keep a positive attitude towards your dogs and try to appreciate them in any way possible. In this way, you can encourage them to participate more and enjoy the activity itself. You can also train them with a clicker if you'd rather not give your dog treats or use verbal phrases to boost them. You can use a clicker whenever your dog modifies his behavior. You simply click it, and the noise it produces serves as a stimulus that you are about to give a treat. 3. Go to a comfortable training room. A comfortable and distraction-free training room is a good place to start for this trick. You must inform other members of your household so that distraction can be less when your dog is practicing. Your dog will be moving for quite a lot of time, so a wide floor space may also come in handy. 2. Training your dog to roll over. 1. Start giving the command to your dog to lie down. You can command your dog to lie down so he can do the rollover trick easily and safely. You need to ensure that his head is lifted. Paws are in front of him and are resting on his stomach. 2. Hold a treat near your dog's face. Once your dog was able to lie down, level down your body, and hold a treat where your dog can see and smell it. Make sure it comes close to your dog's face, but also ensuring that you close your fingers so he can't snatch it from you. Just make sure to keep an eye on your fingers if your dog can quickly snatch treats. It's also their talent. 3. While moving the treat, say roll over. You can easily and slowly rotate the treat up and around your dog's head. His nose will eventually follow the treat later on. You must also say roll over in a clear and pleasant voice while moving the treat around. If you are able to lead your dog's nose with the treat's direction, your dog will eventually roll over to the other side and achieve the trick. You can simultaneously use both verbal and physical signals when you command your dog to do this trick. These two may come in pairs to serve as your key to this quest, but it is also okay if you prefer a rolling motion signal with your hand. You can do it in any way possible. 4. Assist your dog and continue practicing. No man is an expert in their first try, likewise with the case of our pets. You need to help them in their first tries, especially if your dog is having a hard time moving on his own. You can assist your dog with your free hand by gently helping them to roll over their body. Give them reward treats for every successful move they make during your practices. Pet your dog and express that they are doing a great job. They are the cutest and tend to respond positively to a good remark. 5. Know when it's reward time. If your dog is doing a great job during practices, you might as well give reward treats for the correct action he made. But you shouldn't spoil the purpose of what you're doing by continuously giving treats for successful attempts. You can lessen giving treats to your dog, once this new behavior of rolling over is reinforced. The next time you get to command him with roll over, he surely knows what to do because your dog expects a reward afterward. 6. Keep preparing your dog until he can do the trick without assistance. Once your dog had few successful attempts, it is possible that your dog can be able to roll over without your assistance. Moving treats and hand signaling may no longer be needed at this point. If your previous practices are effective, you can simply tell your dog to roll over, 
and you will get a response. If it is a success, make sure to reward him with a treat. 3. Polishing the trick. 1. Continue practicing until treats are no longer needed. If your dog has been successfully doing a rollover without your help and responds quickly, it's time to taper the treats you give him for a great job. You can slowly stretch intervals of when you are going to give your dog a treat and gradually give less appealing rewards. You need to keep your dog interested in doing rollovers. Thus you need to remain unpredictable too. 2. Do the trick in a different location. You have successfully imparted the rollover trick to your dog, and you shouldn't stop there. Introducing your dog to a new practice location can help to fully associate the trick with him. The new surrounding may have alongside distractions that can challenge your dog. You can slowly reintroduce treats until he is able to adapt over the new location. 3. Perform the trick around other people. The rollover trick command is not only limited to dog owners. Once your dog is used to practicing in front of other people, they will eventually get used to performing it with ease. You are in the last phase of this trick if your dog rolls over when someone else gives him the command. Your dog will surely enjoy this trick, especially for the extra praise he gets from other people. Thanks for watching. For more dog training tips, click on the link below and get your free dog training video series.